Well, I, I think the hardest part is always performing as a, as a singing artist. Uh, and just being a host is what I think is not very demanding. Um, it's, it's an easy job. You don't have to say more than 20 sentences uh, on the show. So, I mean, there's nothing easier than that. I think I'm, I'm the serious one in this uh, team, yes. <laughs> and um, yes, you will see when, when, you, when you watch the, uh, the finals and the grand final on Saturday, uh, everything will make sense. <laughs> Exciting. Um, I'm looking forward to having a lot of people in front of me, around me. I think that is the most exciting and interesting part of the whole show. The fact that so many people are in the room who share, um, share the moment. And this might sound pathetic, but I think that's what the Eurovision Song Contest is about. I think we are, we are diverse people for a diverse audience. We have countries in which the Eurovision Song Contest is a very uh, serious music contest. And we have countries and we have some people in the audience who like to see a cult show. And I think um, that, we, that, we can do, that we can do everything that, that everyone feels, um, yeah, feels good seeing the show. I'm not scared, but um, if I uh, if I were Judith, I would be scared because it's, it's new to her, and uh, I think yes. she 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 uh, she's very very scared. No, I'm not scared. Uh, you, are, you are, you are. <laughs> and for me, it's 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 a uh, it's a very easy job to do because yes. it's I mean this is what I do every day. Yes. Same, same, women, same, same, man. Yeah. <laughs> no emotions. Easy job, I'm not scared. <laughs> Tell us, are you, really, are you really scared, Judith? Uh, this thing cannot work. I mean, have you seen all the cables and all the big screens? So everyone that has ever tried to uh, install a stereo hi-fi at his home knows that this thing is not going to work. So be prepared. <laughs> The Eurovision Song Contest is part of my life uh, for a long time now. Uh, when I was a child, we, we watched this with the whole family, and when I was a student, we, we, we did a lot of partying around this Eurovision Song Contest. And now, uh, now I'm one of the presenters, and normally I'm doing news, and I have a talk show, so it's something different for me, but I'm really, really looking forward to do this. I've been watching it for so many years, and this, uh, for me, is, a, is a kind of a dilemma, because I really don't know uh, whether I should be part of the show, which, which is my job, or whether I could just be a fan, you know. For some reason, I cannot really join in. I cannot call my friends and text, text with them and check out who has uh, which favorite song and artist. So um, I'm really, really glad to be here, and I enjoy being in front of people. I enjoy working and performing in front of 10 people, 10,000 people a hundred million people, it's no difference as long as the energy is a good one. It's it's gonna be it's gonna be a great great evening. All three evenings are gonna be very great and I really look forward to sharing the moment.